Welcome back, LHS. I'm Jared. And I'm Finley, and this is your Blue, Blue Devil, Devil News. News. Do you need a small gift for a friend, or would you like to show your appreciation to a teacher? Now through December 12th, LHS Humane Society is selling candy grams. Here's Brady with more info. The LHS Humane Society is selling candy grams for the holiday season. They cost $2 each or $3 with delivery and a personalized note. We interviewed Ms. Jordan for more information. I am Ashley Jordan and I sponsor the Humane Society here at Loveland High School. Uh, the Humane Society supports animals who don't have a voice, so we support local animal shelters and donate our time to those animal shelters and their events. So we're selling candy grams to um, increase our funds in the Humane Society's account, but also to uh, send money to those local air animal shelters. And it will go through December the 12th. Just buy your candy grams. They're $2 a piece, uh, unless you want them delivered, and then they're $3. Talk to a member of the Humane Society, Miss Wilson, or Miss Jordan to order your candy grams. Bagged by popular demand, the junior class is once again selling crew neck sweatshirts for $20. You can purchase them at the bank or from Miss Alsop in B305. This year's spring musical is now Mary Poppins. Due to unforeseen circumstances, Dance auditions have been moved to next Monday. Vocal auditions are this Thursday, December 8th at 3 o'clock in the choir room A704. The 7th annual snowball is next Saturday in the central staircase. The dance starts at 6 p.m. Tickets are available at the bank for $15. Attire is semi-formal. Final exams will be December 19th and 20th for students who are not exempt. We'll share more about the schedule as we get closer to those dates. T and Ready testing resumes this week with English today and tomorrow. Students who are not testing will be in first block until 10:20 tomorrow, then second until 11:20 with no focus. Third and fourth will be normal. Now let's check in on the weather with Charlie May. Thanks, guys. It is currently 63 degrees and rainy with a high of 68 and a low of 63. It will continue to rain throughout the day and more to follow up this week. Back to y'all. Thanks, Charlie May. The city of Lebanon started a $2.5 million project to replace an outdated and aged water main on South Cumberland that had caused trouble with over 75 commercial properties, homes, and restaurants. The renovation will not only ease this trouble, but it will also be maintained as a reliable service for fire protection. The Wilson County School Board voted to remove two books from its high school's libraries in a meeting Monday night. The two books, Tricks by Ellen Hopkins and Jack of Hearts and Other Parts by L.C. Rosen, were recommended to be kept by the county's book committee. However, the school board voted for them to be removed. Now let's hear from Evan with today's sports news. Thanks, y'all. Our boys and girls take on Brentwood today on the road. Girls start at 6 and the boys follow up. Yesterday, the Buccaneers beat the Saints 17-16. The Saints kept the lead the whole game until the fourth quarter, until Tom Brady threw for two touchdowns. The girl bowling team competes today in the semifinals of the District 11 tournament at 3.30. Girls finish the regular season 11-1. Portugal takes on Switzerland today at 1 p.m. for the round of 16. That's all we have for sports. Back to you guys. Thanks, Evan. That's all for you today, LHS. I'm Jared. And I'm Finley, and this has been the news to you from, from the, the White and Blue. Blue.